<laughs> yeah, morning everyone. Um, I was driving along the road just outside of Livingston and I came across this really interesting clump of contorted seeds. And it comes from a type of grass called Heteropogon contortus. Now I have no idea what Heteropogon means, but contortus is really interesting. These seeds make these tight clumps and then what happens is in, in the summer months it rains and the most amazing thing happens. Let me quickly show you. But just to show you one of the seeds, I don't know if you can see that, but it's got a long awn and then right at the end it's got a really sharp barb. And I'll show you why. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to lick this just to put some moisture on it. And then to show that I'm not using my fingers to twist it, I'm going to plonk it into my shirt or my jersey. And then let's see what happens. Well, from this one, you can see nothing is happening. Let me find another one. My experiment is not going too well so far. Let's try this one. Ah, there we go. Can you see it starting to twist in? So it starts straightening and starts twisting. And that's the reaction between the moisture and what's in the seed and it just burrows and so that's the contortion that happens and that's how it got its name uh, it dries out during the winter lands on the ground and then when it starts raining it has this reaction and the spike goes into the soil and this is how it drills its seed into the soil an absolutely phenomenal evolutionary strategy which has allowed this grass to survive a terrible grass for sheep in Australia they've got huge problems with this because the seed gets caught in the sheep's wool and that devalues the, the sheep's wool but what an amazing evolutionary strategy hey eh?